Well, a local nonprofit is making sure that families facing the unimaginable are able to have a happy holiday. It's all thanks to the Punt Foundation and its annual Adopt a Family Gift Exchange. And two on your side, Keelan Berrien was there and he joins us to tell us more. Keelan? Yes, yeah, Scott and Mary Alice. You know, today allows kids to just be excited again and just be kids for the day because any other day of the year, these children are focused on beating cancer. It's a week before Christmas. I think we've got like three families oh, coming in. And out in the pew. All right, anything else for Bradley? Is the Adopt a Family program giving gifts to a few? I think it's wonderful. This is my second year with them, and they are amazing people. And Kelly Rosenberger is picking up presents for her grandson, Ethan. He means more than my, my children. <laughs> He's six years old and was diagnosed with leukemia. This is him and his two sisters. When we, he was first diagnosed, I made a promise to him that I would stay by his side and we would fight this to the end. And that's what you're doing today? Yeah, sorry. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I don't want you to no, cry no. or anything like that. I'm so sorry. No, because I'm happy he's in remission. Punt Pediatric Cancer Collaborative provides financial, practical and emotional support to families dealing with pediatric cancer. It's very hard to reconcile the most wonderful time of the year with childhood cancer. Gwen Myziak is the executive director of Plan. We're here to do something to just take the burden um, off, you know, give families one less thing to worry about. They have so much they're already dealing with, right. so. Because this is truly the most wonderful time of the year. Merry Christmas to everybody in Western New York. <laughs> With now 70 more families. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Oh. Sharing the Christmas cheer. Yeah, take care. Oh, no, Maziak says she's been working with local hospitals since October on adopting that family. She says no one, not only are children getting active treatment, are getting gifts, but those who battled it before or lost a child within the last year are also getting gifts. On your side in the studio, Keelan Barry and Channel 2 News.